first question that I want you to ask before starting a program is, where's the proven results? Where are they? Ask for before and after pictures. Let's see some action. So if they're just putting up pictures of like a half naked super fit chick who's been starving herself to get that perfect photoshopped like picture, there's something wrong with that. I'm talking real results from people that when you actually enter that gym, you will see there. Not something just framed up on the wall from people who have come and gone, but people that are actually in there still working out, still changing, still adapting, still making a difference for their body. Tavo, how much weight have you lost, brother? 40 pounds. Maria, how much weight you lost, girl? 30 pounds. Badass rule, how much weight you lost, brother? 50 pounds, baby. Hey, Miss Steph, yeah. how much weight you lost so far, girl? 50. Bam! You should be able to see that from any good fitness business. The second question that I want you to ask, is it customizable? A lot of programs are one size fit all, right? The boot camp model. We come in, we put 50, 60 people all together, and then there's no way to actually customize it. Because in reality, we sit at a desk too much. I'm sitting on a bench right now. Shoulders are rounded, low back has back pain. We drive too much, we carry our kids. I know, because I just had a baby. Knees have issues from just years of stairs and different things and sports. It needs to be customizable for you. It needs to be able to adapt to your body. It needs to be something that forms and fits to you, not you trying to fit to that program in some crazy like get this amount of work done in this time or else, keep up, like no excuses. Because in reality, anybody can make you sweat, anybody can make you tired, and anybody can make you sore. That doesn't take skill, that doesn't take knowledge, that doesn't take certifications, that doesn't take training. Right? Our goal is to actually make you better in the long run. It's not about the short term, six week, eight week, 90 day. It's about what helps you in the long run. So is it customizable? And ask that on the front of nutrition as well. Because in reality, if somebody just hands you a meal plan that's one page long and it says like protein and veggies every meal, nothing else, chicken and veggies, chicken and broccoli, tilapia and broccoli, you're not going to stick with that. It's not customizable and it's not attainable and therefore it's no longer achievable for you to see lasting results. Let's learn some habits, some habits that'll help you in the long run, habits that you can pass on to your family, habits so that no matter what, you can look back and say, I don't have to worry about putting that poundage back on. I'm not going to yo-yo, I've learned and it is a part of who I am now. This is a lifestyle change and it is not a diet plan. It is not a meal plan, it is not a nutrition plan, but it's a part of who I am. So if it comes with a meal plan, I would have you question, right? Because I'm not even a fan of meal plans. We take what you're already eating and shape it to make it healthier based on wherever you're at. So question if it's customizable, all right? And then the third thing, last thing, is sustainability. So ask from a business perspective, who inside the facility has been there a year? Who has been there two years? Who has been there since three or inception, depending on how long it has been around? Because if it's just a program where they're really good on marketing and they're just focused on like getting lean, tone, fit, lose fat, lose weight, and bringing a bunch of people in for that initial little bit of money, then that's probably what they're going for. It's all about money and not lasting results, not building a fun community, and not making sure that you're actually sustaining everything, then I would have you question. So look around, ask them if they've got people within that facility and there should be a good chunk of them because otherwise it means they're not good at all those things or they're not continually delivering results or it's just not a fun, safe, lasting place where people want to be. And if it's not that, why would you want to be there either? Then it just becomes one of those things you just pay for and don't even go to. So those are my three things that I strongly recommend you asking before starting any program so that you can get your money's worth, you can find the right fit, and you can finally get the results and stop with the yo-yo. So like I said, if you're not feeling that great, ask those three things. Where are the results? Show me the proof, right? Is it customizable? Because probably something is going to come up or something needs to happen, right? And how long and where are those people at? Let me see some long-term stuff going on here. So those are my three questions for you. I hope you find the perfect program for you for wherever you're at, whatever it is. Movement is a gift, use it or lose it. So just make sure you're doing something. All right, oh hey, here's my dog, sneaking in the video. On that note, peace be the journey, Coach Brosif, I'm out.